Ku Hyesun was one of the most famous celebrities during her early times, especially when she starred in one of the legendary K-dramas, Boys Over Flowers, which really helped her reach stardom. Ever since starring in that drama, her future seemed bright until it wasn't. The last time we saw her acting was in 2017 for the drama You Are Too Much, in which she only appeared in the first six episodes out of 50. The reason why she fell off so badly is that she got entangled in one of the worst scandals a Korean actor can get into. Unlike any other actors who had to go through a lot of auditions, Hye Sun was easily discovered due to having a pretty face or what people would used to call an ulzong. For those who don't know, ulzong is a Korean slang that literally means best face or good looking. It eventually became a status and people had to judge and cast their votes in order to achieve this title. Even before joining the entertainment industry, Hye Sun already had some fans and followers after her photo became viral. As early as her high school days, she already established her own fan club. She was used to being in the spotlight, but could this be one of the reasons why she wanted all the attention during her most controversial scandal? She did get what she wanted when she starred in Boys Over Flowers. This show was a huge hit in that it became most of the cast's turning point and helped them build their foundation as actors. And Hye Sun was one of them. She once revealed back in 2021 that at that time she was still living off the money she made from Boys Over Flowers. When she shared that information, it had already been 12 years since the show aired, so you can imagine how rich she got from starring in that show alone. A Hye Sun was at her peak during her young years. It looked like she had everything from fame, fortune, a unique look, and even a love life. She later revealed that while filming Boys Over Flowers, she was dating someone, but eventually their relationship ended due to the show's overseas filming. This was the only relationship she revealed aside from the one she had with her now ex-husband An Ji Hyun. Hye Sun shared that experience around 2020, and at the time, people had no clue how bad her behavior was behind the scenes. Hye Sun appeared in a couple of other dramas after Boys Over Flowers, but nothing could beat the popularity and attention she received from it. By 2015, she starred in the show Blood Together with An Je Hyun. And yes, this was where their love story started, or should we say the root of their tragic love story, but we'll get into that later. Blood made a buzz not because of the plot itself, but because of Je Hyun and Hye Sun's blooming relationship after meeting on set. In fact, the drama received poor ratings, and at the same time, Hye Sun received a lot of harsh criticism due to her terrible acting. Her acting was so bad that netizens were able to gather thousands of signatures for a petition for her to be replaced. Blood was actually the second to the last drama she did before she stopped acting. A year later, she and Jae Hyun announced that they were officially dating. Just two months after the confirmation of their relationship, they surprised everyone with their wedding announcement. Netizens even admired them more when they figured out that instead of having a luxurious wedding, they decided to have an intimate wedding. And the next day, they donated a lot of money to a children's hospital. A year later, Je Hyun became the standard of a good husband after showing his sweet and gentle side on their reality series called Newlyweds Diary. They looked like a perfect couple, but since it's a reality show, everything is not 100% true, and we all know we only see what they want us to see. Behind the scenes, like them fighting for hours, was of course not included. During that time, they were still in what they'd call their honeymoon stage, but fighting for hours during the early stage of their marriage was probably already a sign that they weren't compatible. In August 2019, everyone was shocked when Hye Sun suddenly announced Jae Hyun wanted a divorce. We usually see this kind of news from the artist's representative or agency, but Hye Sun handled it her way and posted the revelation through her personal Instagram account. She even included a series of screenshots of her conversation with Jae Hyun. At that time, both of them were signed under the same company, HB Entertainment. Entertainment. The company eventually released an official statement confirming both actors were getting a divorce. It looked like Hye Sun wanted everyone to know about the news coming directly from her. She kept on insisting she never wanted a divorce and wanted to fight for their family, while Jae Hyun was, according to her, the only one pushing for divorce. But it seems like there's a reason why she decided to announce their divorce in the first place, and it was all very calculated from her side. She announced their divorce to have the public's side and take note the first thing she said was she never wanted a divorce because she wants to protect her family. But it turns out it was actually her who filed a divorce in the first place, and not Jae Hyun as she tried to make it appear to the public. An acquaintance of theirs revealed that she wanted to end their relationship, 
and that she already handed the divorce contract that she made with her lawyer to Jaehyun. Hyesun had no comment regarding that, but instead, she continued on exposing Jaehyun as a terrible husband, accusing him of various things. She claimed that Jaehyun had a change of heart and held intimate calls with several other women. Right after explaining her side, an old interview from their show, Newlywed's Diary resurfaced. Well, here's what really happened behind the camera. One of the writers revealed that he had a hard time filming due to Jaehyun's personality. They made him look like a romantic on screen, but in reality, he was like any other husband. Aside from that, another producer revealed that the couple used to argue a lot inside a room where there were no cameras in it. They would go inside for an hour or two, but they were inside also six long hours at one point. During this whole ordeal, everyone was on her side, while Jaehyun received all the hate and at the same time lost some of his endorsements. He only wanted to settle everything quietly since it was a private matter. He didn't want to notify the press, but Hyeson did the complete opposite and broadcast everything on her social media, which made it seem like even in this situation, she still wanted the spotlight. Hyeson was far from stopping, so Jaehyun finally decided to speak out and release a statement in which he denied a lot of her claims. Since their divorce announcement, he only released statements through his agency. He posted a long letter on his Instagram expressing his feelings and what they've been going through. Jaehyun shared that he really loved and respected Hyesun, and that's why he wanted to marry her. But after three years of marriage, he ended up having mental problems. After sharing her side of the story, it turns out she left out a lot of details and even distorted the truth, which hurt a lot of people. Because of this, Jaehyun had no choice but to break his silence. Hyesun also demanded a lot from him before she would sign the divorce papers. She even added the calculation of her clean their house during the whole duration of their marriage. Jaehyun agreed to pay every single cent she demanded, which led him to take up loans and he even sold his house. He also brought up the time when she broke into his house, even though they were no longer together. After hearing Jaehyun's side, netizens started to dig up some of Hyesun's flaws that could help him. Since Hyesun was non-stop accusing him and revealing false information to the point where it was already hard to believe, people remembered the rumor that she claimed to have a pathological lying disorder. Right after Jaehyun's statement, of course, she had more to say. She added another reason why he wanted a divorce, or we can say another reason for her to make Jaehyun look like the bad guy. This time, she revealed that he no longer found her physically attractive. She didn't stop there and continued on exposing Jaehyun. She shared a video of him during his birthday where he celebrated with a few females in which she claimed he was cheating with one of the girls he was with, but it turns out he was only with his stylist as they celebrated with him after they were done filming. She also accused him of cheating with a co-star that he was filming with at the time. Even before Jaehyun released a statement, both of the actresses that were involved immediately said that they had no romantic connections with Jaehyun. After what she'd done, people started to question her actions. She insisted on on wanting to protect her family, but she kept on revealing everything to the public. It seemed like she was manipulating people the way she manipulated him in order to get what she wanted. After a very long, messy, and public divorce, they finally reached a settlement on July 15th, 2020. On that day, both were officially divorced and decided to go separate ways. After all the controversies she had, it seems like she's currently moving forward and trying to improve and focus on herself. She recently shared a milestone that she's about to reach as she graduates from a university University with a Latin honor of summa cum laude, she shared the good news through her Instagram by posting her graduation photo along with a caption stating the details of her success and thanking her professors who helped her as well. As for her life as a celebrity in February 2024, IOK revealed that Hyesun would start anew in their company. The company pointed out that despite her being active in various fields, they wanted to focus on her as an actress. With these all laid out for Hyesun, we're all curious about what she has to offer as the new version of herself. 